did get the aluminum door hold backs as an upgrade. Um, those cheap plastic ones always break. So, uh, got rivets, screws there, coils. Um, that is my hoist that pivots over and I can hoist my coils up onto the machine. All my drills, saws, um, shears, everything like that, charging station, screw boxes, sealer, um, all miscellaneous hand tools, leaf blower. If you don't have a leaf blower, I suggest get one. That is, saves up a lot on cleanup time and you can leave your job site cleaner than what it was when you arrived. And yeah, that's where I keep my elbows. Um, I usually keep white in stock on the trailer and then colors I have in stock in my shop. And I keep my extra guillotine in storage up here and set it on the side of the machine where it comes from the factory because I think it takes up too much room on the side of the machine. Adapters. Um, one thing I don't like yet and that is my guard storage for my guard um, I have five foot guard and four foot guard and it's just I haven't found a good way to store it and so I got a fan there for in the summer we got LED strip lights in shop towels cord um, reel and my eight foot tripod ladders are on that side and we'll go around back and look in from the, the back of the trailer. Okay, the first thing you'll see when you open the door is a fold down table for the miter saw. And when we get to the job, first thing that comes out is a box of hangers and a bucket. Got my tripod stands there and down spouts. I can fit three boxes downspouts I got a 28 foot ladder and a 24 foot ladder slid in beside there and caulking guns saw there's where my tripod ladders are and I actually use my guillotine storage for a caulk WD-40 things like that down table my matter saw and one thing I do like about this setup here um, I don't know if you notice when that's folded up I can still run gutter through there um, with the saw folded up so if I don't need the saw for that job I can just let it fold it up and shoot my gutter out below there. So that is my trailer setup. So far I've been pretty happy with it. The only thing I need to figure out yet is a better storage option for my guard. Originally that was an extra spot for a downspout that I just capped it off. But I just need to figure a better way to arrange it. So if you got any ideas on that, Leave it in the comments below. Uh, this is where I keep end caps for the day and outlet boxes on top of my machine here.